clearly struggling. Hey everybody, it's your girl Sincerely Dre, and I'm back today with another video. from the side down below today i will finally be doing my dorm haul and unboxing so if you saw my video from before you saw i did some online shopping so most of my stuff from online shopping is here now and i'm just going to show you guys everything else that i got as well there are some things that did not get here in time from that video and i just got a kitchen tool set from amazon i'll put a picture up over here because this year your girl will not be doing a meal plan i'm going to try to do like my own cooking and all of that stuff since i already know what i like so it's better just for me to make what i like instead of paying for a meal plan with food that i don't really necessarily like so i will be cooking this year so i will be getting a kitchen tool set and i also got the curtain lights that i showed in that video as well because I wanted to do something different. I know last year I had fairy lights, but I use those in my room now and I just wanted like something for my whole wall. So those are what I got that won't be in this video. So I'm gonna start with unboxing everything that I got in the last video and then we'll go into everything that I got from the store. So there's a lot around me. So I'm not gonna go in any specific order. I'm just gonna start with the stuff that I got online. Like I said, this first thing I got is from JC Penny. And uh, this is my microfiber sheet set. So it's just a gray sheet set. It comes with the flat sheet, fitted sheet, and the pillowcases like it would usually come with. And I got this in a full because this year your girl will be in a full bed. No more twin. So I got this in a full. It's just throw it over there. <laughs> And the next thing, this one is from Staples. Okay, so this is my disinfectant wipes. I needed some, or these are hand sanitizing alcohol wipes from, from Staples because I needed some disinfectant wipes. I'm pretty sure you can still use them as disinfectant wipes even though they're hand sanitizing wipes. But I just got three of these, all the same ones, because I needed some. And last year I got mine from BJ's, but they were sold out. And they were also sold out at Sam's and everywhere else. So these were the best I could do for now. The next box, or let's just do this box here. It's a bigger one. You can't really see. This box is a four tier shelf. And I mainly got this for my TV. I'm not really sure if there's a space for me to put my TV in my room right now with everything else that I'm going to have as well. So my mom wanted me to get something to put my TV on. So I got this four tier shelf and I put my TV on the top and then of course use the other shelves for anything else or for any other storage that I need. The next thing is from Walmart. Okay, so in this box, it's just my... Clorox toilet wand. So it just comes with the toilet wand and the container that it goes in and the refill so you could clean your toilet. This year I do have my own bathroom, so of course I do have to clean it. So I just got this so it's easier to clean my toilet. The next box in front of me is from Target. And this box came a little beat up. I don't know why or what they did with my box. I don't think there's anything in here that could have broke. Though, but let's check and see. Bubbles, 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 bubbles. Okay, so in this box, I just got some rose water facial toner. Not really like a school thing, more just like a skincare thing. So, so I got that. Um, I got a Coolander, a a a coolander, a coolander, whatever. But the thing that you use, like when you make pasta or anything like that, that you have to strain. I got this for that, so it has like little holes on the bottom. 
not sure if I'm gonna be making pasta, but you never know. You always wanna have stuff just in case. The next thing that I got are some sheer curtains, some white sheer curtains. I know y'all saw last year, I got some sheer curtains as well. But this year, since I do have my own room, my own bathroom, I also have a common space in my living room sort of situation that has another window as well. So I wanted to get some more curtains for that window. And then I have the curtains from last year in my room. But you'll see all of that later on. This is actually weird though. I don't know. This, this material kind of feels more like a bathroom curtain, like a, a bathroom, a shower curtain, more than like the curtain that you would use to hang up. But who knows? Um, and the next thing that I got in here is just this dish drain board situation because I have a dish rack, but I needed something to put under it for all the water to drain out. So it has like this little area for it to drain back out into the sink. And then you put your dish rack right here. So yeah, and that's what I got from Target, or at least from Target Online. And then I have one more box. Y'all, this is the biggest box. You can't even see, but like, this is the biggest box. This one is from Walmart. I also cannot really remember what I picked up. Clearly it was something big. Okay, yeah. So this box includes one of the things that I told you guys to get for your dorm room essentials and must haves. I gotta get up for this one now. Let's start with the stuff on the side. So, There's like powder on all of this stuff, which is weird. So I'm gonna have to clean these things off. But I just got some snuggle scent boosters. I got put onto these when I was at school. I just picked them up from the CVS. I don't really remember why, but there's CVS near at the end. I picked them up. I really can't remember why, but these smell so good. So I had to bring them back because these aren't like the detergent that, this isn't the detergent that actually cleans your clothes, but this is stuff that makes it smell good. So this smells amazing. So I had to buy some more for this year. And then I got some extra strength carpet odor eliminator, OxyClean things. It's like the stuff that you just shake on your carpet and then you vacuum over it so it can smell good and it gets all like the dirt and all that out of it because I need my place to be clean. So I'm gonna be using this, especially when I first get there to clean the carpet and all of that. Um, and the last thing in this box is my mattress topper. So remember I told you guys that you needed a mattress topper so that your bed can feel good. So I got this one, it's a full size because of course I have a full size bed and it's three inches so your girl will be sleeping on a cloud baby on a cloud okay so that's all that i have for the things that i bought online that i'm unboxing now i'm gonna get to everything else that i bought in the store that i've been keeping up with for like a couple months now so one of the first things that i got from the store for my new dorm is this shaggy rug i actually got two of them oops <laughs> i actually got two shaggy rugs they are just the ones of my mainstay at Walmart. It's a 4.5 feet by 4.5 feet by 5 feet. And I got two so I could put one in my room and then one in my living room. They were really cheap at the time. Like it was on clearance for maybe $5. This sticker says 19 on it. I don't know if you can see this. But that sticker says 19 on it. But I got these for really really cheap so I just picked up two while I was at it because shaggy rugs if you know and if you've been shopping for shaggy rugs you would know that they are not cheap not at all so when I saw them I said oh I gotta get them and they were the first things that I got for my dorm this year and from here nothing is really in any order it's just whatever I pick up first because there's a lot of stuff in front of me okay so the first things that I got are these grip liners 
I got both of these from Ross. They were $6 from Ross. And I'm going to be using these to put in the cabinets in my kitchen instead of contact paper because the contact paper last year was a little bit tough to pull off of everything it wasn't hard like it didn't have any residue under it or anything but it was just tough trying to pull them up so we just got these liners and i'll be using these liners to go in my drawers as well before i put my clothes down in those drawers that everybody named mama has used so i got these two liners from ross the next thing that i got from ross are these clips for a bag because like I said I will be I won't have a meal plan this year I'll be making my own food so just in case I have any bags of anything that needs to be clipped up I got these they were six dollars and it comes with 15 so I just picked them up just in case you can never have too many clips and if I don't use them at school I can always use them at the house too the next thing that I got from Target was a microwave cover so you know in order to keep your microwave clean so like things don't splatter all over the place while you're cooking you want a microwave cover so I just picked up one from Target and I also got some sunscreen if you watch my dorm tour you would know that the sun in Athens Georgia specifically like I know from Atlanta Georgia all that but the sun in Athens is different especially when you're not in a car and you're walking everywhere you want to get you some sunscreen because the tanning and just how long you've been in the sun is just too much. So I got those from Target. Next thing I got was from Home Depot. And I just picked up three power surges or power strips. Y'all already know about these. I talked about these in my essentials and your must-haves for college because like I said, I have a lot of electronics and last year I bought two, but I only came back home with one because the other one, I just don't know where the other one went. So I had to buy another one to replace one that I missed and because I have a bigger room, I need another one this year and just another one just in case. If not, I can always use it at the house. So I just got some power surges for that. Also from the dollar store, I got some knives. Y'all, I did not know that the dollar store is so nice. So I really hope that these are actually sharp. But the dollar store does sell nice, and I needed some because like I said, I will be cooking, so I do need to be able to cut through things. So I just got these two paring knives from the dollar store. And I mean, if they don't work, they only cost me a dollar. I can always go and buy some more, but I got those because I saw that they was at the dollar store. And you already know when you're in college, you be trying to save your coins wherever you can. <laughs> The next thing I got was from Ross again, and this is a scrub daddy. It was $3, and it's kind of like, um, it's like a sponge, but it's like those sponges that are more rigid, like a scour sponge, like a scrub sponge, <laughs> and you're, you're able to use it for things that are harder to clean off of different things. So I got this for that reason. This is like the mouth part. You can use like put spoons and all that sort of stuff in. So this should make it easier when cleaning dishes. And I got this from Ross and it was $3. This next thing I got from Burlington, I picked up a 14 piece food storage container. It has seven containers in it with seven lids. I got this from Burlington, it was $8. And I picked it up because I thought I will be cooking, so it's just easy to put everything in here. And because it was purple, and one of my favorite colors are purple, so of course I had to go ahead and get this food storage container. And it's seven, so it comes with like a whole lot, and it didn't cost that much. So if it does break, you know, I can always get another one. The next thing I got is a three set portable container. So I'm probably gonna put like rice or cereal or pasta or something in here. And it's just three containers in here. And it was $7 from Burlington. All right, so the next thing that I got was from this place called Ollie's. I don't know if it's like a place that's all over the place, but I would say that I should have shopped at Ollie's earlier because they do have a lot of stuff that are like more on discount or cheaper, but it's just still regular high quality stuff. So I picked up these two curtains to go in my living room. They were both $7 each. 
and it's really cute because it has like white and gray and our colors for our living room space is white or there they are white gray teal and yellow i believe i'm not really sure but you guys will see it if you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can see my dorm tour but we'll be using these in the living room along with the curtains that you saw earlier the next thing that i got was from big lots i got two rectangular little bins and they were 350 i got these from big lots and i'm using these for my paper towels so if you can see behind me right here this year i'm not doing like the regular round paper towel i'm going to be doing like the ones that you would get from like if you're outside or at a business place just because they're easier to use and they don't take up as much space so i need something to put them in so i'm going to be putting them in these and it will keep all the water outside so the paper towels don't get wet and it's just like a nice storage container for them and they're easy to clean as well the next thing i got was from ross i also i got some more knives just bigger knives so if i do end up needing to cut like chicken or anything that's bigger that you need the bigger knife for like lettuce any vegetables i got this it was six dollars and it's just two knives i got these from ross for cooking so yeah the next thing that i got was some reusable gloves some reusable cleaning gloves so when i do end up cleaning i probably won't use these for cleaning dishes but when i just clean the whole area in my bathroom if i'm mopping or anything i'll be using these gloves i got them from walmart and it's just some reusable gloves that of course you can reuse the next thing i got from walmart is a bed skirt i'm not sure if i'll be using this bed skirt or not but of course you guys will see when i do my room tour i just got this gray bed skirt and it just goes around to cover everything at the bottom and i also picked up some sanitizer from Walmart as well. I picked up three bottles of sanitizer. So hopefully these should last me. I have some other ones from last year as well. But I just want to pick up some sanitizer just in case because I don't like, I don't, when I'm at school, I don't like going to the store for a whole lot of stuff. I like to have everything ahead of time. So I just pick these up so I don't have to be trying to order things online every single day like how I was last year because I forgot something. <laughs> The next thing I got, this was from Home Depot. It's just a duster so that I can clean off like the windows and everything when I get there because I do know that, that the cleaning staff does clean, but I always wanna do a second clean after then just to make sure that everything is clean myself. So I'll be using the duster to clean off like the window and everything like that when I get there. The next thing that I got are some vacuum storage bags. I got this from Ollie's as well. It was $7 and it just comes with three large flat bags. These are the bags that, you know, people that you see online with like as seen on TV type stuff where you put things in the bag and then use the vacuum and it sucks all the air out. That's what I'm gonna be using this for. I'm gonna be using this to put my clothes in and you guys can see how it works and all that if you Hit the notification bell so you can see my pack with me video. You'll be able to see how I use these and how it's gonna help with packing. This next thing I got is also from Ollie's. It is a sponge caddy and it's just teal. So this is one of the colors that we're doing anyway. And when you use these little suction cup things that are on the back and you suction it onto your sink and you would put like your soap and your sponges and all that stuff in here inside the sink so that's what i got this for and it was two dollars so a pretty good price for a pretty decently sized container i also got this next thing from ollie's i just got this bath mat it's purple i don't know if it's showing up as purple but it's a purple bath mat and i just got two they're the same type and they're from ollie's they were five dollars each so i'll be using this in my bathroom of course the next thing that i have is from jc penny my parents actually got this for me so i'm not sure how much it costed or no it does say the price on here but they just got me another hand towel from jc penny and this was twelve dollars from the tag and 
they got me a blue towel from jc penny as well like the full body towel and this was 16 dollars just so i could have another towel when i'm at school to use of course The next thing that I got is from Walmart. This is something I'm gonna be using to cook with, to make breakfast with. I got a mini waffle maker. I didn't wanna get a big waffle maker because I don't see the point in having a big waffle maker while I'm in college. So I just got a small one so that if I'm feeling for waffles or something, I can whip up some mix and then put it in here real quick and they'll be done for like on the weekend or something instead of having a really big thing that would take a whole lot of time to pull out and clean and all of that. So. I just got a mini waffle maker for if I want to waffle for breakfast or any other time of the day. The next thing I got is from Ross. This is from my bathroom. It is stuck to the bag. I got a bath mat. It's a black bath mat from Ross and has like the little suction cups on it just because I hated, like I didn't hate, but I didn't like having to wear shower shoes all the time when I was in the bathroom because like I wanna clean the, I wanna clean the bottom of my foot. So it's like, okay, I gotta take my foot out the shower shoe and hope that I don't fall or touch the dirty floor. So I really like having the bath mat this year since it's my own bathroom, it's just me in it. So of course I'm gonna clean the tub, but I also want this bath mat to be like that extra layer of protection in between my feet and the floor. So I'm really excited about using this in my bathroom this year. And it was $5 from Ross. The next thing I got was from the dollar store and it's just some kitchen stuff that are all in teal to match like the whole color scheme that we have going on. I just got a regular kitchen towel. I got an oven mitt if we ever even need to use it because we don't really have an oven but you never know when you're going to need it or want it. And I got a pot mitt. Not really sure when I'm gonna use these, but they were all a dollar at the dollar store, so they're easy to replace if anything happens to them. And I could also get the color match with everything else that we're gonna be doing in that little area. This next bag of stuff is from Ross. So I just got this over the door hook rack to put stuff on. It says it's five hooks, but honestly, you could use this top piece as one and the bottom piece as another one, so it would be 10 hooks. And I got this for $6, so of course, I'm gonna put this over the door so I can hang my bags, jackets, anything that I need to hang on here so I can have more space inside my closet and just so it's easy accessible, have easy access to different things. Okay, so the next two things that I got from Ross are these helper shelves. And you can put them in your pantry to like fix different things up or like your cabinets. So I'm gonna be using these. I'm probably gonna put my TV on top of one and then the other ones are probably gonna go in the cabinets. But you guys can see where I put these and what I use them for in my dorm tour as well once everything is all set up. But I just got two of these little helper shelves and they were $6 at Ross. The next thing I got was from the dollar store. It's just this little welcome mat. It's not anything fancy or anything, but I just want to put it inside of our little apartment, little area in front of the door. So like if it's raining or something and your shoes are dirty, you can like put it on top of this before you like trick it everywhere else inside the little apartment. So just something nice, simple, cute, and I had to spend a lot of money on it because it was from the dollar store, so of course it was just a dollar. And the next thing I got was from Target. And I just picked up this mattress pad because I already know I'm trying to sleep on a cloud. So I got this mattress pad. It's a cool touch waterproof mattress pad. So yeah, it's the same mattress pad I got last year, but in a bigger size because of course this year my bed is bigger. 
And yeah, I do recommend this mattress pad. The same one I had last year. I would most definitely go and get this. And it was on sale as well, so I got it for $20 instead of whatever the full price was for it. This next thing I got was also from Target. And yeah. So these are just some masks. Because of course, this school year we do need a mask. So I went to make sure I have one for every single day of the week. And Target has two masks for $4. So I just picked these up from there. And yeah, just regular masks to use when we're at school since we have to wear them. And you should be wearing your mask anyway. Boom. <laughs> the next thing I got was from Big Lots. Oh yeah, these are just some disposable gloves. They were $1.50, it comes with 12 in here. And I just got these because we're gonna be moving in and you know, you wanna clean everything down. So I just got some gloves so that our hands could be clean while we're cleaning everything down before we start moving everything into the door. Next thing I got was from the dollar store. It's just some all-purpose cleaner. Yeah, I think this is all-purpose cleaner. It is some all-purpose cleaner for me to use to like clean my bathroom, my tub, anything like that. Just regular cleaner. The next thing that I got was from, I got this from BJ. So it's like a big wholesale store, kind of like Sam's and Costco. I just got a whole lot of sponges. It comes with 21 in here, so I'll be set for like the rest of college, most likely. So I just got a whole bunch just because why not if you're going to be saving money on it. And since I'm going to be washing dishes and all that, I got sponges, of course. The next thing I got was from Sam's Club. It's just some cooking spray because, of course, you're going to need cooking spray. So just a random thing that I bought that was with everything else. And the next couple things I got are like just some big things that you need to clean while you're in school. So I got this big tub from Sam's Club of hand soap because I'm just gonna be doing like refilling my bottle instead of paying extra money to buy like a whole lot of different of the small containers from the store. So you just buy one container or you buy like the pump, the soap dispenser and then you refill it with this. So this should last me a long time. And then I also got some dish detergent, the same exact thing. This is just dish soap. So I have a dish soap right now and then I'll just be refilling it with this dish soap once that's done. And this should last me a good amount of time as well. And the last cleaning thing or last bulk cleaning thing that I got was you know you gotta clean the floor, so I got me some Fabuloso, just so you can clean the floor. Cause in our dorm, there is area that does have carpet on it, and there is some area that is tile. So of course you wanna be able to clean that down every now and then. So I got some Fabuloso so I could clean and mop the floors up. So it's not like all dirty and sticky and whatever. <laughs> The next thing that I got from Sam's, yeah, is some hand towels. So like basically face towels because I needed some more from last year. So I just got this, it comes with 12. I'm probably not gonna be taking all 12 with me because I do wash my stuff every week. So having 12 will just leave a lot that won't be used every single week. So I'm probably just gonna take like seven or just a couple of these in, in addition to the ones that I had last year. So I can have a hand towel for every day of the week and I could just wash it at the end of the day so I'm not using a dirty towel. The next thing that I got is a pure water filter. So it's the same thing kind of like Brita but it's, I think they said this one is a little bit better, I'm not sure. And it's bigger so I just got this. It comes with two filters in it so I should be good for this semester before I have to buy some more. And I just got this because last year there were like filter dispensers in my dorm area but this year i don't know if they have them or not and in our room or in our like dorm area we have a refrigerator but the refrigerator doesn't have of course the water dispenser like getting water from it so i got this so it makes it easier we could just fill this up with tap water and then it will filter it out so it's better water to drink 
and that should help us from having to like take trips to find a water fountain. So yeah. The next thing that I got was from Burlington. I got these full size sheets, they're just purple. So of course I had the gray ones from early and I have purple ones because I like to keep two sheet sets on me so that when I'm cleaning one, I can always use another one or just in case I just wanna change up and have a different little style or look in my room. I just got these purple ones and they were $15 from Burlington and it comes with six things. It comes with a flat sheet, a fitted sheet and four pillowcases. Unlike the other one that only came with four things because this one has two extra pillowcases in it. So yeah, the next thing that I got was this. Um, this curtain rod because I do have one curtain rod like I said from last week that I'll be using in my room but we need another curtain rod for the living room and I got this from uh, Ollie's as well it was $2.39 so yeah then I got this from Sam's Club as well it goes with the toilet cleaner little one that you saw before but these are just the refills so of course I can clean it because you're gonna need more than what they put, what they give you in there so I just got the refills so I clean my toilet of course um the next thing that I have behind me I'm not sure if y'all can see I don't think so but I got this mop and bucket of course you can get any other mop and bucket from like the dollar store or Walmart or any place it's gonna do the same exact thing but I got this one in particular because it has like this little spinny area that I guess will be able to help it dry faster and wring it out better so I don't have to touch it because I'm a slick germaphobe so I don't want to be touching the dirty mop or whatever so I got this one but of course you can get any other one and it will work the same exact way and this one comes with like the little mop refills and I believe that these refills all you have to do is just put it in the wash I think and it cleans itself so you don't have to buy extra so I feel like this is a really good investment because I'm gonna have to clean my floors anyway so I just got this and I'm pretty sure further on into the future I'm gonna have to clean floors again in any other apartment or anywhere, where it, or anywhere else that I go so I got that to clean my floors now on to what y'all probably been waiting for is my comforter my pride and joy I got this comforter from Ross. I know a lot of people have been finding it really hard to find comforters for a good price, but I really suggest going to Ross in Burlington and don't just check once because there were so many times that I went and I didn't like what I saw or what I saw was too expensive. There's one time where I went and they had them that I really like. It was like a 10 piece set for only $50, but it had everything in it. And I didn't go, I tried to go the next day and didn't have it, I was so mad, but you want to hit up Ross every now and then because they get new things in every week compared to other stores. So I got this comforter set. It's a king size. So it's really big. It doesn't, so it's going to be bigger than my bed, of course, but I really like the way that it looked. So I just got it anyway. And this comes with this big comforter that you see right here. It comes with this, the pillow shams and two decorative pillows. So it's gonna be really cute. And then I have everything else for my bed that will follow it as well. And you'll be able to see this fully in my dorm tour as well when everything is put together. Then I got these paper towels as y'all saw before. I just got it in bulk right now because if you've done dorm shopping before, you know that when moving happens and everybody's moving in into the same area at the same time, it's gonna be really hard to find things because everybody is buying it right then and there because of course a lot of people do last minute shopping. I was one of those people last year. So I wanted to make sure that I stocked up on this stuff from now so that I have enough to last me until everything restocks and I can get it again. So I just got some paper towel from, um, I think I got this from BJ's. You could get it from Sam's, Costco, any other places, but I got it from BJ's. Then I got in the same 
like category. I got some toilet paper because at my school, I've heard other schools do this, but at my school, they don't give us toilet paper in your own bathroom. I know some schools give their students toilet paper, but at UGA, they don't do that. So I bought some toilet paper because I do have my own bathroom and you need toilet paper when you use the bathroom. So I just got this big case of 45 rolls of toilet paper and I got this from Sam. So of course this should last me a good amount of time too. And then the last couple things that I got from the store are, I got this pillow from, still a bag on it. But I got this regular standard pillow from Walmart because I just wanted an extra pillow for my bed. So I'll have this pillow and I'll take one of the pillows off of my regular bed that I already have at the house. So I have my two pillows in the back. And then I got these two bigger pillows to go in front. And these, the pillow that I showed you before is a regular standard size pillow. And these two pillows are a king size pillow. I had to get king size in these bigger pillows because my bed set is a king size. So if I try to put the king size pillow shams on the smaller regular pillow, it would be way too big. So I had to get these ones. So these ones are going to be the pillows that go in the front and the smaller pillows will go in the back, of course, and the decorative pillows and stuff in between or in front. So I had to get these big pillows and I got these ones from Ross. I got the other one from Walmart and these ones from Ross were $19.99. So it wasn't too bad of a price compared to other places. So that is all for this video. That's everything that I got from my dorm as of now. Everything else that I get from my dorm, you guys will see in my dorm tour. So make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you guys are able to see everything that I got in here and how I use it. Also, I'll be doing some packing with me videos because of course, now that I have everything out, I need to start packing because school is coming up very, very soon. So I'll be having some packing with me videos because I need to start packing very soon along with some moving in with me videos. And of course, the finale of my dorm tour so you guys can see how all of this comes together, how it's going to look, my room, my roommate's room, everything. So I want you guys to make sure you guys do not miss that video because you do not want to miss that video don't so make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you can make sure that you are notified when that video comes out and make sure you guys follow me on instagram at i am sincerely drew so you can see more of the moving in process me going to the store to get anything else because i post on there more often and remember that i love you guys and my name is sincerely drew and i will see you in the new video